Hi guys, Hyperlative here, the Norwegian gamer, and this is some gameplay from Bad Company 2, with me playing some squad deathmatch. Now this is a, a game mode that I can't really say I've played too much because I didn't really enjoy it, but um, I just tried it out now recently and found out that I'm pretty decent, so I actually ended up playing it uh, quite a bit. But the thing that I really wanted to talk about is um, the future of the Battlefield franchise. So, Leon Trotsky recently put up a commentary where he talks about the future of Battlefield, and more specifically Battle Battlefield 3, which is the next game that's going to come out in the Battlefield franchise. And he talks a little about... Uh, what we kind of, what do you think might be there, and what we might expect in the um, upcoming game, and also what we would want. And he actually talks about uh, including kill streaks in Battlefield 3, and he he doesn't like it, and neither do I actually. Uh, I really have to admit that kill streaks is one of the things in Call of Duty that really can ruin a game. I mean. It, it ends up being so many lucky kills and just so many frustrating elements with kill streaks, and it kind of um, ruins the uh, the illusion of realism that's kind of lost in Call of Duty by now. But still, I I think it's not something that shouldn't be in Battlefield. And if dice include that in Battlefield Three, I would would be really disappointed. I mean, they did try to make a good multiplayer in. Medal of Honor. Although it's a decent game and a decent multiplayer, it isn't what as good as um, as uh, Battlefield Bad Company 2. And I really hope Battlefield 3 will be just a an iteration of the multiplayer that we have in Battlefield, and would we, will just get better. I mean, I really think that the Bad Company 2 multiplayer is a step up from the one in Battlefield 2. So. I really hope that uh, Battlefield 3 will be another step up. I recently watched a video uh, about what we know about Battlefield 3, uh, where they actually mentioned uh, some of the leaks that happened all the way back in 2007. Um, and although I believe some of those might be true, I also believe that some of them might actually be something that was incorporated already into Bad Company 2, and it's probably gonna be this. It's probably gonna be some of the same in Battlefield 3. I uh, like um, they all in the video. They mentioned that there was gonna be there's gonna be five classes. The four that you uh, you know in Bad Company 2, including a support class. And traditionally, the support class was the kind of uh, heavy weapons with extra ammo kind of guy, or, or at least in ba Battlefield 2. And that's kind of what the, um, well, it's kind of split up, because now it's, the assault has the ammo and the medic has the heavy weapon. So it's been kind of spread out. So I I don't know if there's going to be five classes. I don't think so. I think they've kind of found their sweet spot with the four different kits, as they're called. And I, I'm, I believe they're going to stick with that. Uh, it seems like the video is coming to an end not too far up ahead of here so I'm not gonna go into more detail right now but I want to put up another video where I talk a little about a little bit about um, what they're gonna do with uh, frostbite the uh, game engine that runs the recent battlefield games and also the multiplayer in Medal of Honor so that's it for the uh, for now and I hope to see you next time Snuckus.